Miss Rand, uh, you have said that your primary purpose in writing is to project the ideal man. For those who may not have read uh, Atlas Shrugged and have not yet met Hank Reardon or John Galt, how would you describe the uh, ideal man? Well, it actually took me about 700,000 words I know it in Atlas Shrugged <laughs> to describe him, so it's impossible to give a description, but I could tell you only the essential characteristics mm -hmm. above everything else. A rational man. A rational man. Rational man. A man mm -hmm. guided exclusively by reason, an independent man, and a man of great self-esteem. Mm -hmm. I would name these three as distinguishing characteristics. The essential ones are what I regard as an ideal man. Mm -hmm. So a rational man then would depend upon nothing except his own reason for uh, determining his actions, Exactly. No, no belief in, uh, or no, no, uh, uh, no belief in anything he couldn't see or touch? Uh, that isn't exactly not, the not definition quite. of a reason. Yes, uh -huh. uh, certainly no belief as faith. Mm -hmm. No faith in anything. Mm -hmm. But reason is the faculty which identifies and integrates the material provided by your senses. Mm -hmm. So you don't smell or touch with your reason. Yes, of course. That's the material yes. which your reason integrates into concepts. Mm -hmm. And certainly an ideal man would never permit himself to act on the guidance of emotions or to act without knowing exactly what he's doing. Mm -hmm. If he's guided by reason, this will be the first two consequences. He will always know what he is doing and why, and he will not act blindly, and he would not act uh, because he felt like it. Mm -hmm. To my ideal man and to me, this is one of the worst, most immoral actions that anyone can permit himself to say, I did it because I felt like it. It's quite all right to feel, but feelings are not tools of cognition. They are not... Uh, guides to reality and you keep your feelings to yourself feelings are the consequences of thought and action not the primaries well if i the didn't guides. If, if i didn't do it because i felt like it why did i do it i did it because because you felt <laughs> now you see how yes. bad language is <laughs> right because you concluded Concluded. consciously that this is the right thing to do mm -hmm. right for whichever goal you're undertaking mm -hmm. you decide what you want rationally and you choose rationally what steps you will take to pursue that goal so that if you take a given action you do it because you think it is right mm -hmm. 